I'm just looking at how long this I've been going. We're up to, about, we're up to uh, 38 minutes. So it's, that's two videos have passed. So there's been a video gap between this and probably between this and me challenging people to say what they think the final boss is. Uh, it'll be interesting to see what people have if people if people have said anything. It'll be interesting to see what they say. I mean, people may already know what the final boss is. I may have looked it up with my tantalizing vagueness about it. Yep, go for him. Although he might be healing. He might. Eh, I think he might be healing us after each fight anyway. Rough nose here, did you? Ooh. I think actually, we Warcry. We Warcry against the guy who's worse off. And if we can, we might end up fight attacking the other guy. Or doing some damage to the other guy. I don't think we'll kill him. Uh, kill the other guy if we get rid of this guy. No, okay. So he. Oh, is he still gone? He might, no, he is gone. Gets to. I might tag you out for Eden. And then he can rupture armor. Oh, you're not down. <sighs> no, stop killing him! Stop, stop, stop hurting my squishy. Um, well, you're nearly dead though, anyway. Piercing Knight. Probably should be thinking of using that, actually. It weakens melee attacks. You're not dead? Ah. I probably should have gone for Bane of Sauron done the that. Oh, right, no, I didn't need to. Didn't think so. Just had a sudden thought that maybe I should have done. That's, I think that's it. I think, that, I think that's the last of the Pelennor Fields. I know what you're thinking. I know we're gonna next. We're gonna go to the Black Gate. Oh, I think well, we have a cutscene now. She barely lives. What is this? A Morgul blade. I was too late. I shall not fail. That, that, that's not what. Uh, uh. Thor. I am here. Because Idriel didn't want me to be her. <laughs> You have rekindled hope in me. Let us face the days ahead, together. My liege, how may I repay you? You bow to no one. How may this be answered, my lord? We gather our full strength and march on the Black Gate. The darkness is deepening. Suffered a defeat, yes, but... Behind the walls of Mordor, my enemy is regrouping. There is no life in the void. So, Black Gate, that's where we're going. <laughs> no. 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 No, we've marched up to Barador, climbed the top, and now we stand here, before the very eye of Sauron, fighting, fighting literally the eye of Sauron. <laughs> the, 
<laughs> the more I say it, the more ridiculous it sounds. Ah, <laughs> uh, 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 I needed that. We are literally fighting the Eye of Sauron. It's 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 like how do you how do you stab the Eye of Sauron? Ah, oh, this guy seems to have a lot of armor, which is why I kind of wanted to hold on to Morgul Decay. Because like this is doing like three thousand with Morgul De with Morgul Decay with no armor, it'd be doing thirteen thousand. So you get to do it again. That's probably yeah. We'll do it. We'll do it because we set up for it. Who I probably should have kept his action points safe. I mean, admittedly, at least we're not we're not we're not missing the giant fireball that's shaped like an eye. Um, the giant flaming eye. We're not missing it like the giant elephants. <laughs> uh, who 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 wrote this? Did have had they ever you know read the books and understood what? I assume we, I assume putting them, to sleep, putting him to sleep will not work. Mushrooms doubles action points. Uh, more will decay. So now what I could do is Wrath of Edoras now, without any armor on. 13,000 points of damage. I could be using my perfect mode as well. Darkest fear on Berathor. No! Am I immune to fear? Or is this a special kind of fear? Because it's called Darkest Fear. It might be a special kind. <gasps> it looks like it might be. Oh no! A thing occurred! Oh, he took damage. Is that it? More wins back. Uh, I could actually... Cleansing Waters. Get rid of the fear and everything. That'll be useful. And it looks like I get a second action. Yeah. Um. Could loud or fear actually? Most the strength. But he's the next. Foe's next attack. I don't think he'll be stunnable. Uh, I think we'll leech inspiration. Hey. I have to stop that. <laughs> I mean, admittedly, doing things like dispelling that is probably really good because oh no, it does da it does damage as well, even though he's meant to be immune to fear. But yeah, didn't yeah, didn't yeah, didn't yeah, didn't yeah, didn't. Drop away at your health. I think you. I want to be doing things like this multiple attacks that. Uh, I think cleansing waters is good, just to get rid of this a bit, this effect. Um, and it also means that he doesn't get get two free attack, two free moves. He'll get a move, and then I'll get a move. Then I can stop messing things. Now everyone, now no one can use their um, thingy, spirit powers, which does mean Idril can no longer heal. I haven't got any other way of preventing that. Sword crap. I could tag out. All my perfect modes. Actually, what's. Perfect modes. Fangorn Bash. So I can't do Roots of Wrath. Is that because I don't have the action points? It might be that they qualify as. So let's actually tag out for. Had Hod. So, if he were to use perfect mode, he can go all the way down. So, Banner of Elendil. That's messed with my game several times. I don't really want to do that. Uh, Spirit of Gwai here. They're around! Gwai here's around! Let's use it. Yeah, Gwai here's around. He's saving Frodo and Sam from actually saving the world by destroying the ring rather than... Fighting a flaming eye on top of Banandor. Ah, uh, that was a waste. I could have just attacked. Ah, uh, ah oh well. I should have just done Turin's Wrath. That would have done a decent amount of damage. <sighs> Ooh, 
Oh, a double critical. How delightful. Oh, actually, if I double attack, I can double Jurin's Rock. Admittedly, that, looking at that, that does mean I'm going to end up really messing with speed. Oh, because that's thinking I'm going to be stunning. Yeah, I thought you'd be immune to be, being stunned. Um, so you can look and see what's going to happen there. So I'm actually going to... He's going to have to get two in a row. Spirit defense. That would probably be useful if I use any spirit attacks. Which admittedly these two guys can't do, can't use at the moment. And now Hadhud can't either. But, I mean, using Paralysis of Light when two-thirds of the party already have it impacted is not so bad, really. Wrath of Sauron, he's doing a lot of damage. Oh, he's draining my health! The meanie! I've got no way of actually healing. Because <laughs> Idril's, um... I think he'd... What has Elagos got? I don't think Elagos can actually do anything in this. I can't... Oh, I can't use spirit powers. What happens if I say I'll use an item? Ooh, I can use an item. So if I go for... Oh, no. Some of them... And do I want, what do I want? I want? No, I actually want a decent amount of health coming in, because he can start whacking really hard with this ability. Bag of old Toby. What? What happened to my, the health I was gaining? It was meant to be greater! Right, we're not going to be doing much with that then. So I think what we actually need to do is we need to go down and grab Waters of Lorien for full health. Considering Greater didn't really achieve anything. If I do anything, you're going to... Yeah, if I... Do, we'll just do the Horse Lord Skewer so he doesn't get his... He doesn't get two attacks on the bounce. Barathor was afeard, okay. I think he was already afeard, but alright. And then Edros. It's alright. Barathor claimed to be the, the protagonist at the end of this. He was the hero who saved the day, etc, etc. Even though he's terrified at the foot of... Stop stealing my health! It's almost like you're evil or something. Yeah, I keep saying I'm going to be stunning you. You're, you're immune to stun. I know this. Yeah, I'm really going to slow down. But I need to chip away at this health. Because I'm actually doing enough that even if he does do his um, Wrath of Sauron, drains a lot of health. There we go. Speaking of the maneuver, um, it's not going to have a huge impact on me. What I could probably do. I mean, actually, if he takes out. Oh, I don't think that's. I don't think it'd be too bad if he does that. But um, I can now. Yeah. I won't kill him. He might kill Eodin. Fairly sure all three of them already had the effect. I mean, I'm, I'm... I shouldn't complain. I'm applying this effect that's already applied to all of you, okay? You insist. Right. Uh, would I prefer to switch out to someone else? Uh, more one, maybe? I mean, not that a, a thief craft is going to do any good at all. I don't know how much damage that's going to do. If I do one, yeah, let's just do the one attack. It also means I've got someone with a lot of health who can tag out to some... Oh, no! No, that's just... That's just mean. I hope fear runs out, otherwise I'm in deep trouble. Because I know that's two-thirds of my team is affected by a fear ability that I can't get rid of. Unless there's a way... Is there a way to get rid of fear? Let's go down and look, because it'll be close to the bottom, so I'm just going to... 
Action mem attack momentum, foe's armor's gone, spirit power, sleeping water. Okay, that oh, that, no, that's spirit immobilization. Melee. Oh, that applies. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Shadow Edge, Earth Spirit, doubles action powers, steals health from the attacker, steals action points for the attacker, oh, for the attacker. Stores action points over rounds, stores health over rounds, increases initiative, uses initiative of a group. Single enemy to sleep, I don't think it's going to work. Reduces damage, reduces damage, reduces attack damage. I think we're going to have to use the... What was it? Waters of Lorien. It's a bit of a waste on Morwen, but... I'm kind of worried that the fear effect is permanent. I mean, it might not be. But I don't, I don't recall it ever really being cured. He just keeps applying it. They just keep applying it to the same person. I think it might be a bit of a problem with the AI. Like, he keeps doing that effect, so it doesn't do anything. Oh, Berethor's going to get a turn soon. That's good to know. I don't think I've got anyone who can actually take any turn. Any, I don't think anyone's got any multiple attacks. I mean, is it dual, can I, it, it dual spirit power now? Nope. Although, actually, if you remove the spirit from it, spirit power, it's the... Yeah, that's going to be an issue. I think I'm going to have that anyway. I may as well go with Eirdin. And just try and... Hummel him with a spear. <laughs> Flaming Eye, the last avatar of a god. Being pummeled by a spear. <laughs> yeah, what was that? Two... That's 4,000-ish health. It's nothing, mate. Absolutely nothing. Everyone! Get him! <laughs> it's not, not, even the, not even one of the main characters did it. R relatively main characters. One of the companions, at least, did get it. There are other great tales of this age that you shall hear in the fullness of your lives, of great bravery and fellowship beyond <laughs> Of a king who faced death to buy time for a friend. What the final boss should have been. Or the final section, the maybe. The smallest of us, changing the future of our world. Of the destruction of evil and the triumph of good. We're on. We're up there, by the way. Okay, maybe, not anymore. We're not there anymore. Of the departure of the elves from the history of man. Of how the fellowship of the ring, those eternally bound by friendship and love, began and ended. But those are not your story. Your tale has hardly begun. Oh, were they going to do as, as like a sequel called The Fourth Age or something? It's only half sarcastic, that question. <laughs> 